Seneca and Erica Boston Public Schools say in the coming days they will have extra personnel, extra security out here. But there are still questions tonight about why those metal detectors were taken out and not put back. Boston police pulling up to Charlestown High School for the second time. Canines leading the way. They searched the school for weapons after a 13 year old student with a gun was arrested. A second gun also found inside the school. A 17 year old also charged. She called me crying because he's scary or they have something happen. This mom says her 13 year old daughter called her to say she has a class with one of the students who was arrested. She was waiting for answers. Tell me he ended the same class. I don't know. A source confirms metal detectors were removed from the school. Students say they want them back. They were taken out due to COVID uh, rules since we had to be six feet. They took the metal detectors off and like we never expected this to happen. So it's kind of surprising and scary. It's the latest in a string of incidents raising concerns about safety at Boston Public Schools. Weeks ago, three students at different schools were attacked with Chromebooks by other students. Parents concerned police were not called and concerns after a father flashed a gun outside a school during a fight. Police didn't learn about it, they say, for two hours. Earlier, the superintendent defended the schools. Once we get a report, we report it as fast as possible to our BPD. Um, our school leaders obviously do some initial fact finding and then they'll make their phone calls as soon as possible. Mayor Wu did come to the school to get debriefed, but she declined to speak with us. Boston Public Schools did release a statement a short time ago calling this a serious breach, saying that it would not be tolerated, adding they are grateful nobody was injured. We're live here at Charlestown, Charmitzketty, WCVB News Center 5.